Hi, we know two types of the optical stabilization systems used in modern digital cameras. The first one is based on shifting elements within the lens. This is Canon 7D with 1755 lens. The second type is based on the sensor shift within the camera body. And this is Olympus E5 with 1260 lens. Let's try to check which of the techniques is more effective. Obviously, making pictures with just camera in hands is not a good idea. To achieve a reliable result, we must have a stable, reproducible impact. So, we took elements of the famous LEGO construction set and made a vibration table or vibra stand. Here, the initial impact is applied. The lever system reduces the strength of vibrations and transmits them to this moving platform. The system is fixed to prevent an unwanted slide. The screwdriver rotation frequency is continuously adjustable and that's actually not good because we don't have fixed frequencies. However, there is at least one accurate position, fully press button. To measure a rotation frequency we make a video and this gives us 6 rotations per second. We'll use a fully charged accumulator for each series of shots. And so we have a vibro stand with fixed vibration frequency of 6 Hz. Changing geometry of the lever system we can vary the amplitude of vibration from fractions of millimeter to several millimeters. We can adjust the platform to the specific camera model. By the way, the camera is not fixed inflexibly. Some elastic mobility is retained, but this is actually not bad from the safety point of view. We don't want the cameras to break into pieces. Frankly speaking, our vibra stand looks not very serious. However, it provides the main thing, reproducible impact, the same from shot to shot and also gives us possibility to change the strength of vibration for the next series of shots. You can find results of our testing at www.onphoto.ru